Uh, I'm, I'm Jim Collins. I'm a, a family physician. Brian uh, Egan is one of the principals. He, he uh, graduated Frontier. But Brian had a technology business that uh, called Advantage Home Telehealth. We've been, done some really interesting, innovative things uh, with home care, assisted living care, uh, uh, nursing home work, and uh, uh, some hospital emergency room business. So we've seen this kind of expand. Pulse, uh, blood sugars, weights, blood pressures, uh, spirometries for people who couldn't breathe well. And that information would be sent to our office where we would uh, monitor them. Um, what we've next come to is telemedicine, uh, which we really embarked on fully last year, actually it been about uh, 12 months ago. Uh, we do some work in nursing homes throughout New York State. Uh, and probably the, the biggest, most impressive thing we've done is working with uh, People, Inc. We were able to decrease hospital emergency room visits by about 50%. We have the telemedicine visit. There's a documented note. If there's a script that needs to be written, we send that script uh, electronically to the pharmacy. And then a note gets generated for the primary care doctor to be able to, to send that off. Um, and so uh, everyone is informed about what happens. But what other opportunities do we have to be able to use this telemedicine to keep people where they are rather than uh, tra traveling to an emergency room or even their primary care doctor. Brian uh, has made the initiatives here with the Frontier District to be able to uh, do something very similar to our people program here in the, uh, in the school district. I mean, so there's, it's a busy, busy, busy uh, office, and there, were, there are opportunities for us to use this. And then um, in, as we get into the cold and flu season, there'll be even, even more and more opportunities for this.